for the laughter Early in the morning Down in the kitchen Watching TV You were the music That led me to the sixth string And now it's been so long Since I've heard you sing I looked up to you, brother Even when you lost your way In the madness of New York City Oh, you found her And now I know there's hope for me welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel today it is tuesday it is about 7 a.m and i'm waiting for my friend to come pick me up because we have our first day of in-person classes which is really exciting um the only reason i'm wearing makeup today is because we're taking our badge photos and they told us to dress professionally so i'm wearing my makeup and my pink johnny scrubs which my boyfriend's family got me for christmas and this gray jacket that my boyfriend got me for christmas so i'm wearing that today but normally i would not be wearing makeup or probably not even wearing contacts because i'm pretty lazy and then i have my lunch ready to go yes i was drinking dr pepper i slept for probably like four hours last night because i was super anxious and i like could not sleep so that's why I'm drinking Dr. Pepper before 7 a.m. And I have my clinical backpack, which is completely filled. It's gonna break my back. I'm headed out to the car right now because my friend just got here and I'll talk to you guys when I get to school. <laughs> you wanna be in the vlog? Yeah! <laughs> Dude, it's actually, I watch yours. I watch it. for coffee, first stop past the place. Five years later. Okay, sorry, it's been a minute, but I just got home. It is about 11.30, 12.30, I'm wrong, it's 12.30. Um, but I just got back from lab, which I'm still wearing my stuff. This is my white coat. We didn't get to have a white coat ceremony just because of COVID, but we did get our white coats today and we took a picture in them. So kind of felt good at least. Um, and then we had to pick up all of our textbooks for all of the ATI exams that we're gonna be taking throughout the program. So that is what is in there. And then we picked up our program iPads. So everyone in the program has an iPad. Kind of use it for class notes, lots of things. So here's my iPad, I put it in a pink case. But I just set that up and then came home. So that is why it's been a minute. But it's lunchtime, I'm super freaking hungry. I did pack a lunch yesterday so that I would have something to eat today. So in my lunchbox today, I have a water bottle. Very important because today I drank Dr. Pepper for breakfast. It was just one of those mornings. I have my sandwich in here, which I made yesterday so I wouldn't have to stress. And I have some fruit snacks, which I'm not eating this whole thing. I just put half of it in for today and half of it for Thursday because I have to pack lunch Thursday as well. So I'm about to eat lunch and get on to my next lab. That first lab was health assessment lab and now I'm about to get on to my adult health lab, but I have about 30 minutes before that starts. So I'm going to enjoy this piece while I can. <laughs> So plot twist, class is going to start at 2 today because some people are still on campus getting their iPads. But I just put my paper like on, which I'm really excited about. But look how many bubbles there are. And I like followed the instructions and I was being really careful. So I hope they come out. It says if there's little bubbles that they come out in the first few days. But I feel like there's a lot of bubbles. So right now I want to set up my Apple Pencil, which I've never used before. Honestly, I'm not sure how much I'm going to like using the iPad because I'm already a little frustrated with the bubbles. It's just going to drive me insane. And I'm really good at putting screen protectors on, so I don't know what happened with this. But anyways, here is the Apple Pencil, and it's brand new, which is kind of exciting. I'm not sure how to, like, use it. You walk into the altar, and now she's going to share our family's name. I looked up. Okay, so after looking like an idiot for a while, I figured out how to connect the Apple Pencil. So I wanted to show you, this is not sponsored, but I know a lot of YouTubers use this, so that's why I bought it. But um, I have paper-like on this iPad, so you can write something as simple as hello, and it feels like you're writing on paper. 
and you can even like change it to where you could draw with your finger or um what was it i think i hit this one i put hello and it converts it to text just like that so you could handwrite your notes but it'll type it for you so if you have bad handwriting like i do or at least my handwriting is good sometimes but whenever i'm taking notes in class it definitely doesn't look good it converts it to text for you so i feel like that's kind of nice honestly but i really don't know how to use apple pencil or an ipad so i'm not going to sit here and pretend like i do i just thought i would show you my new toy <laughs> Okay, so I just made a huge mess on my bed of everything from class, but here are all of my looks, which are really nice because they're going to get me through the whole program. So they were really heavy, but at least I have them all now. There is my lab notebook right there in my folder. My stethoscope and all of that is in here. My camera case because I'm vlogging today. This is for this semester, so I kept it separate. And then here's the rest of my bag, completely filled. So if you want me to do a what's in my lab bag slash clinical bag, whatever, please let me know in the comments. I will definitely make one. But right now, I'm getting ready for class. So I'm getting my laptop out. And our class is now from two to five instead of one to four because people were still on campus. So I'm getting on for that right now. To you, brother, even when you Lost your way in the madness of New York City. Oh, you found her. My favorite time of the day is floraling time. I successfully made it through both my labs today, so that is nice. Currently laying on the floor because sitting in a chair all day really hurts your back. But it's 5 o'clock and I have a little break from 5 to 5.50 to probably make dinner. I'm not sure yet. And then I have to do tutoring until who knows when. <laughs> and then I will be doing my night routine and getting some homework done. So yeah, it's been a long day. I'm really freaking tired. Like I was falling asleep a little bit. But it was really interesting. So I loved it. I just was really tired. <laughs> okay, so for dinner, I think I'm going to make some angel hair. Capellini, it's my favorite pasta in case you were wondering, with some pesto and some Parmesan cheese because I love pesto. I'm also allergic to tomato sauce, fun fact. That's what I'm gonna have today and it's gonna be great. Cook with me. I know you guys love my pasta montages, so here you go. Now I know there's hope for me. I know there's hope for me. dinner and I FaceTime my mom which was fun but now I'm trying to get on to my tutoring and I guess like someone misspelled my name or something happened but the link is not working with my name so that's sad because that means I can't get in and nobody's responding to my emails and it's been 30 minutes so it doesn't look like I'm getting tutoring tonight which is very frustrating. I really need tutoring especially in this class. I was really hoping that this tutoring session would give me clarity but I can't get in. Anyways, I'm done with my rant. Uh, I'm just gonna take it as a sign from God to take it easy tonight, even though this is gonna come back and bite me in the butt. So, um, I have my first exam ever in nursing school on Thursday, which is dosage calculation. It's pretty easy, I really like math, and it's like pretty basic math, so I'm not really worried about it too, too much. So I'll probably study for that tomorrow because I have no classes tomorrow, so I'm just gonna use that day as like a dosage calculation study day. And tonight I'm going to listen to my pathophysiology lectures, which are also for Thursday. But I'm kind of one of those people who likes to have everything done before I can like really study or else I'm just going to think about everything that's going on and get like overly stressed. So yeah, I'm going to do some pathophysiology lectures. There's two of them. I just held up four fingers when I said two. That is how tired I am, guys. I'm really tired today. Two lectures I'm doing today are on inflammation and infection, so those should be pretty easy. I don't know. Inflammatory response can get complicated sometimes, I think, but we'll see how it goes. Now that I'm not on camera, I don't have to wear my white coat and scrubs, so I'm going to change into something more comfy, if you know what I'm saying. Love is something you do make me believe I took off my makeup 
and I took a shower and I'm wearing an extra large t-shirt and I'm living my best life. I know my face looks really red right now, but it's fine. It's just the water. Anyways, so right now I'm going to clean up this mess of all this new stuff I got today. Mostly all these textbooks because I need a good spot for them. And I'm going to organize that backpack because it was unreasonably heavy. So yeah, you guys are going to organize with me really quick. And then it's just going to be like a study night. But also a go to bed at a reasonable hour kind of night. And wake up when my body wants to wake up in the morning kind of night. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be great. basement in Brooklyn the first day I met her I could see it in your face she was all that you need I knew from the moment she was begging you to just sing she'd be my sister and she so I was just talking to Kyle while I made some hot chocolate and finished cleaning my room but lately I've been obsessed with hot chocolate I don't know sometimes I just remember it exists and I like need it so here's my hot chocolate, which is cooling down right now. It is way too hot to drink. But I'm going to do my patho lectures on inflammation and infection. This is also my favorite class, which is kind of funny because most people hate this class. I'm just built different. Be your everything. I looked up to you, brother. I just finished my pathophysiology lectures, so now I'm getting ready to just go to sleep. It's actually only 10.20, so I'm going to sleep a little early, but it's only because I did not sleep last night and I'm trying to get into a better habit of going to sleep when I'm tired, you know? So yeah, but it feels good because I'm going to cross off those lectures. Both of those lectures were actually planned for tomorrow and I did them today, so I'm still ahead. But tomorrow I'm going to just be mostly studying all day because I have a dosage calculation exam on Thursday and I want to get 100 on my first test. That is the goal. So that's what I'm going to do, but I'm going to go to sleep. I'll take you guys on my night routine and then end the vlog. Even when you lost your way In the madness of New York City Oh, you found her, and now I know there's hope for me Yeah, you found her, and now I know there's hope for me Well guys, I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. It was a very tiring day, but it was my first day on campus, and I got my white coat, so I wanted to vlog it and make it memorable. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you watched this whole video, comment some purple heart emojis down below. Also, if you're a nursing student, let me know down below. I just want to know who's watching these videos, and I feel like I've been getting a lot of nursing students lately, but I'm just curious, so let me know in the comments. Introduce yourself. Let's be friends. Give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. I have been so, so, so thankful lately for all of you guys because you guys have been blowing up my channel lately, and it's making me so happy, so please continue to subscribe and hit that like button, and yeah, thank you guys so much, but I'll see you guys next week, and I hope you have a beautiful Sunday. Cause love is something you two make me